China's maritime innovations and prowess on the waves led many to a life on the high seas. The most notorious seafaring individuals were pirates. This goes back to the maritime heritage of China, the maritime Silk Road. The seas were very developed. You have generations of pirates who made a living along the coast. Some pirates made quite the splash, including the most famous leader, Ching Shi. Ching Shi's life on the seas began with her wedding to the Red Flag Fleet's commander, Zheng Yi, in 1801. Zheng Shi was a pirate, married into a pirate family, who successfully carved out a business and managed to thrive. Ching Shi took over the fleet when her husband, Zheng Yi, died and grew it into one of the largest pirate armadas ever. It's been said that Portuguese, British, and Chinese naval fleets all fell victim to her raids and attacks. At its height, under Ching Shi's command, the Red Flag Fleet numbered 1,800 ships and some 80,000 pirates. By comparison, the famed Blackbeard only commanded 300 pirates on four ships. They were a threat to Europeans and to Chinese government. They plundered boats nearby. In the end, the Chinese government couldn't stop Ching Shi, so they offered her amnesty instead, which she accepted on the condition that she get to keep all her loot. Zheng Shi is a defining example of capable, powerful Chinese women. Throughout the ages, China has pushed the boundaries in many areas of exploration, science, and technology. Find out more on History Erased, the world without China.